Hello. I want to leave you with a thought this evening. And that's, uh, who is it now? Somebody called Daniel Rainsbury, 2131, says, uh, why should the result be respected? Uh, will you this time? And uh, I think he's talking about the uh, recent YouGov poll, which suggested that Brexit was no longer that uh, successful, that 46 to 36 percent think we should have another referendum uh, in the next 10 years. And, um, well, you know, I think, why wait for another 10 years? Uh, why not do it as soon as possible? We have elections every four to five years, and we assume that in those elections people change their minds. Otherwise, we wouldn't be running around to the doorsteps, knocking on doors and presenting manifestos. Uh, we assume people can be persuaded of one thing or another. And so the same thing surely is true of Brexit. Why do we assume that people are going to stick to the same decision that they made six years ago? If there's another referendum, they may make a different decision. The events change, we change our mind, to uh, quote the um, diktat of, uh, of John Maynard Keynes, which probably he never said. But um, anyway, it's, it's quite a good, it's quite a good idea. But, you know, why would we, why would we really have a once in a lifetime decision? The same thing is true of Scottish independence. Last time it didn't work. This time it might work. Maybe afterwards they'll have regret and want to come back. But, you know, I don't think referendums work terribly well. I don't think they're a great way of governing the country because people have second thoughts, particularly if the process of conducting the great change is done badly, as in this case it really was, wasn't it? You know, Mrs. May couldn't um, couldn't do the washing up, let alone arrange a, a Brexit. Boris Johnson, you couldn't trust him to arrange a Brexit. Liz Truss, you could trust her to make a mess, and she did. It's like sort of watching watching somebody making a cake without a spoon, dipping her hands in the in the cake mixture and just whipping up a mess. It goes everywhere, doesn't it? Splash, 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 splash. I'm Liz Truss. I'm thinking about quasi quateng Splash. Well, surely we've had enough. Surely we've had enough. Isn't it time to see whether or not people have really changed their minds? <laughs>